All right, while we're on the subject of editors, there's one other editor. I mean, there's a few actually online uh, through your browser that you can use, but there's one in particular that I really want you to get familiar with, and that's CodePen. So I'm just going to make this bigger and let's head over to codepen.io. And what this does is lets you create these little interactive snippets of code where you can actually see your changes in real time. So let's create a new pen. We have div hello. So we've got our HTML in there. We've got our CSS in here. So we can say any div and we can change the color of all divs to blue, for example, and see it takes effect immediately. Font size, 20 pixels, gets a little bigger. Font weight, bold. By the way, you don't need to know what all these are. We're gonna learn about all of these later. I just wanna show you that like these are actually taking effect. And if you know any JavaScript at this point, you can also write some JavaScript in here too, so. There we go, it says alerts test, and then you can just save it and it'll give you a special URL. So this is just asking me to log in. CodePen is totally free, by the way. You don't actually have to sign up for it. Um, but if you want to like save your pens, if you want to be able to edit them, um, yeah, then you're gonna wanna sign up. Again, it's free, it's a great service to use. And so this gives me the special URL. So if I just copy this and go into a new page and load it up. It's going to ask me to log in again. But you can see that all my code is in here. So whenever you're sharing code, whenever you have a question, whenever something's not actually working the way it's supposed to work, uh, if you want to ask either in the Facebook group or if you want to ask in any Facebook group actually, or if you want to um, leave a message down below, uh, I don't know. If you want to share some code with somebody, use this service. This is probably the best one by far. It just, it takes the cake. So learn how to use CodePen. Again, super simple, HTML on the left, CSS in the middle, JavaScript on the right. And as you type, it automatically updates for you. I mean, it's as simple as that. So get familiar with it and make sure you use it because uh, if you ask me to evaluate a bunch of your code and it's just in plain text, um, or if it's on Facebook and it's like, you know, 50 lines of code that is not indented, it's not highlighted, it doesn't have any sort of syntax highlighting like what CodePen has, then you know what? Nobody's gonna read that. So do everyone a favor, including yourself, get used to CodePen, put your code on CodePen, and feel free to share pieces of, uh, like snippets of code on CodePen.